teacher talking sports, what it does, what it do, how we live. And over the past few years, we've seen the transfer portal become more and more utilized in college football as players decide to use it because they get benched, they don't receive the playing time they'd like, or maybe there was a coaching change. So in this video, I'm going to take a look at 10 notable quarterbacks that have utilized the transfer portal and will be playing for new schools in 2023. Let's get to it. I'll name the players in alphabetic order by last name, starting with Hudson Carr. Car card uh, announced yesterday he would be transferring to Purdue. Uh, card started in sporadically the past two years for Texas last season. 108 attempts complete, 69.4 percent of his passes for 928 yards, six touchdowns, and one interception. In 2021, he threw five touchdowns with one interception. Phil Jerkovich. Jerkovich is leaving BC and will be joining Pittsburgh. Uh, Jerkovich, I actually saw him on some mock drafts as a first round pick heading into last this college season. Didn't work out. Boston College was a major disappointment. Terrible team. Uh, Jerkovich last season completed 59.5% of his passes, 11 touchdowns, and 8 interceptions. Next, we have Devin Leary. Things went off the rails for NC State once Leary got hurt at the end of the season. He will be joining Kentucky last season in six games. Leary completed 61.1% of his passes for 11 touchdowns and four interceptions. In 2021, Leary completed 65.7% of his passes, 3,433 yards, 35 touchdowns to just five interceptions. Next, we got Cade McNamara. He'll be joining Iowa. McNamara helped guide Michigan to the college football playoff in 2021, but got benched early on in 2022. In 2021, he completed 64.2% of his passes, 2,576 yards, 15 touchdowns, 6 interceptions, joining an Iowa team who has been known to have one of the worst offenses in college football. Next, we have Graham Mertz. He will be leaving Wisconsin for Florida. Uh, last season, Mertz completed 57.3% of his passes, 2,136 yards, 19 touchdowns, 10 interceptions. We'll likely get a chance to start with Anthony Richardson heading to the NFL Draft. Next, we have Drew Pine leaving North Car excuse me, Notre Dame for Arizona State. Pine last season completed 64.6% of his passes for 2,021 yards, 22 touchdowns, and six interceptions. Shadur Sanders, uh, the son of primetime Deion Sanders, he's leaving Jackson State along with Deion to join Colorado last season. Uh, for Jackson State, Sanders completed 70.6% of his passes for 40 passing touchdowns and 6 interceptions, also adding 6 rushing touchdowns. Next, we have uh, Kadon Slovis. Slovis was a dominant freshman at USC in 2019. Uh, transferred from USC to Pitt. First season with Pitt last year. Kind of disappointing. 58.4% percent completion percentage 10 touchdowns nine interceptions as a freshman he threw 30 touchdowns to nine interceptions slovis will be joining byu next we got donovan smith leaving texas tech to join the passing offense of the houston cougars last season Donovan Smith in 221 attempts complete 66.1 percent of his passes 12 touchdowns, 8 interceptions, and let's end with, I'm going to pronounce this slowly, DJ Uian Golele, that's one of the hardest names to pronounce in college football, kind of like the Greek freak of college football, but um, Uian Golele, I'm going to just call him DJ now, uh, is transferring from Clemson after three years there, he will be joining Oregon State, got benched late uh, this season as uh, Clemson's offense struggled at times last season. Uh, this season, sorry, 2022, DJ completed 61.9% of his passes, 2,521 yards, 22 touchdowns to 7 interceptions. Previous year had 9 touchdowns and 10 interceptions. So there you have it, 10 notable college football quarterbacks 
who will be joining new schools in 2023. There's sure to be more to come as names such as Grayson McCall, Brennan Armstrong, and Spencer Sanders are also in the transfer portal. So what do you think which of these guys will have the biggest impact on their new school? Let me know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe. Like the video, share the video, hit the bell for notifications. I'm out.